jet setting off for another travel immersion. Uh, I got a bunch of guys coming with me. We're going uh, over to Asia um, again. It's the closest place to Sydney, so this is where I do the travel immersions. And um, but before we kick it off, I'm Dave, and this channel is dedicated to giving you no BS, novel, dating advice for the modern man. Top link in the description, check out my website and to do some coaching with myself. Uh, I wanted to talk about being a super nice guy and a correlation that I've noticed between uh, guys that are super nice being disrespected by women and being nice showing this kind of weakness and giving a, a lot of women the go-ahead to exploit these men uh, and it, uh, it puts them in a weak position when they're in a relationship with women and on top of that it leads to the guys uh, kind of becoming depressed so this is something that I have noticed it's, uh, it might not be across the board uh, and I would say there's a difference between being a nice guy and being respectful. You can be very respectful without being a doormat. And I, I, and I like to think of uh, the nice guy as someone who is so nice that when there's signs of them being exploited or walked all over, they don't push back at all. Uh, and so when they come up against a woman who wants to uh, take as much as they can and exploit the guy. Uh, the guy doesn't push back at all, so he finds himself being exploited, talk, being talked down to, bossed around, and disrespected somewhat. And so, uh, if you don't want to be a nice guy, that doesn't mean you have to be a bad person. I would say that mutual respect is really important and you shouldn't necessarily be uh, trying to be mean or anything like that uh, but if you find yourself being too nice and uh, when you find yourself in that situation where you're about to be exploited or you feel like you're starting to be exploited and you don't have the ability or, or the, uh, the skills needed or uh, the confidence to push back uh, then I would classify that as the, the nice guy sort of archetype and these guys they tend to get pushed around too much and uh, without getting the mutual respect and I'll say that when you're in a relationship with women you should always be aiming for mutual respect when a lot of the nice guys don't get that and then they notice that they're not getting that but they don't have the skills or the confidence to push back and to make sure that they do get the respect that they deserve in the relationship then it leads them down this path of exploitation and being bullied by women uh, ultimately ends in a train wreck and the guy sometimes, not always, becoming uh, kind of depressed and uh, having a poor image of himself uh, sometimes ends up leading towards bitterness and anger towards women in general so so anyway um, so anyway I, um, I just want to make that video real quick and uh, as you can hear I'm in the airport there's people <laughs> uh, you can hear okay okay thank you lady um, yeah, it's a bit loud in here in the airport, there's lots of announcements. So, uh, that's what I want to talk about. Uh, when you find yourself in the situation where you might get yourself or feel like you're being exploited, uh, you need to be able to push back and gain that mutual respect. And um, otherwise you might find yourself becoming that bitter, depressed, angry, former nice guy that still is a nice guy but bitter and angry noticing that he's getting exploited in every relationship I think it's something that should be aware of and you should have the skills and the confidence to push back and demand mutual respect because you deserve it don't you otherwise you shouldn't be in a relationship so anyway that's the topic 
I wanted to bring up because I've noticed quite a few guys coming to me with these issues and it is about them not having the confidence to demand mutual respect in a relationship uh, and that's not in a bad way they're just too nice so anyway top link in the description you want to check out my website you want to get some coaching with myself and um, anyway I'll see you guys in the next video